Okay. <coughs> oh, hey. Hi. <coughs> okay. Bye. Welcome back guys to the channel. I know it's been a while I haven't posted anything uh, but um, it's almost May and it's 39 degrees outside so yeah it doesn't quite matter because what matters is where we're going and the weather back there so stay tuned to find out where we're heading. I just landed uh, Copenhagen and found this microbrewery that sells their own brews. I gotta admit that those are pretty freaking good. Um, also, I uh, learned one thing that you can actually take a cup to go and buy a beer and bring it to the airplane if your uh, airlines don't sell um, the beer you like. <laughs> Say A few moments later Alright guys, I just got uh, challenged by this young lady What's her name? Alice Hello. What's your last name? Uh, Stolzermanne Sounds pretty fast a few moments later. How old are you? Twelve. Uh, <clears throat> Forty years old. Twelve. Yeah. Got beaten by a twelve years old girl, guys. It feels painful, but it was a lot of fun. You had a yeah. lot of fun. Yeah, it was very. It was cool super fun. fun. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. It was nice to meet you. You too. Yeah, you can drive. I can tell you, you can drive. All right. Well, her last name is Stoltzermanis. <laughs> the cool thing is, look at this facility, it just, it's, it's awesome.
All right, well, check out the view in the morning. So peaceful, so beautiful. I mean, wow, just incredible. Well, good practice day today. I got another couple of drivers that uh, join me and uh, yeah, we keep pushing each other and uh, practicing starts and passing. Getting a little bit more confident with the passing in the DD2. Uh, still, uh, you know, trying to adjust my driving. Uh, last time I was in a go-kart in November in Tsukusa. Okay, well, here's my uh, partner today. Hi. Hi. Armands. Armands. All right, well, let's go say hi to Mariana, right? Say hi. Hi. <laughs> That's my other uh, practice partner today. My teacher today. Now, practice. <laughs> We're practicing. We've been practicing the last couple of days, so she's getting quicker too. So hopefully she's going to be driving next week. Next week. Next weekend, well, yes. Right. With your help also, I will be quicker. Perfect. Mm. we decided to run the track the opposite direction. And I mean, maybe you remember this pole, right? Uh, yeah, last year I had uh, had some uh, conversation with that pole. It's actually winning right now, one to nothing. But see, this is what happened the, in my last story. So we are running the opposite direction. This is the part where we accelerate and it happened. So yes, I hit this tree. The tree stopped me to, you know, stop me from going all the way down there. So yep, um, I felt the impact. I uh, bruised my uh, uh, my foot and uh, my uh, chest, but other than that, it's totally fine. But yeah, you get up to speed. You have a wheel hub come off. You can't do much. Luckily, there is always a tree. It will slow you down, right? So, tree one, me zero. And that's a pole. Again, pole one, me zero. Still have to, you know, unfinished business with it. Hopefully, I'll win sometimes. Still get to enjoy the day. At the track. Drinking beer. Can't get better than that. Holy shit! <laughs> Beautiful Friday morning here in Latvia and um, yeah it's race day so heading to Kandawa for the first round of Latvian Rotex Championship. It's so beautiful it's about 39 degrees right now and the temps up you know rising and apparently it's gonna be a beautiful day and look at this it's so pretty I mean not a cloud in the sky yet, and uh, I think the temp is going to be in the 70s today. Secret, secret hearing. Some big shoes to fill in. Check this name. Yep. All right, well, three sessions in, and you can see I'm exhausted. Oh, it's a good, beautiful day, a um, lot of grip. 
and uh, yeah, learning how to drive. The track's pretty easy, but still, I'm like one and a half second off the pace. But yeah, there was another couple sessions and quali and one heat race later. All right, by switching the decals, it actually made it even slower. Wonder why, huh? Man malā un mēģinām vēlreiz starta taisnēs zaļais karogs. Grūpi pa priekšu viņam izdodas noturēt savu līderu pozīciju. Tā trases vidu mēģina pirmajā līkumā iebraukt lietuvietas tur sadursme. Mēģina tik garām viņam Tankevičus un Zaļi. Vēl vien no grūpīšanās pie tālā trases pagrieziešus. Otrajā vietā Jūris Zālīts trešais. Just got back from a heat once, so I mean you could see the smile on my face. It actually, went pretty good. Track is open, so I can walk. I can film a little bit, so you can see where we're racing. Pretty fun track. Uh, qualified 13th out of 16, 1.1 second off the pace, and uh, yeah, in the heat one, uh, finished 10th, and was only 0.8 second off the leader. So small improvements. Um, yeah, so happy. I struggle with the you know gear shifting and front brakes again, but uh, yeah, it's fun to be here. This facility is just amazing. Look at this. Okay, pretty cool actually. This track is designed by the Tilke's office. I don't know if you guys can see the track has a little bit of elevation change. You go up the hill, you have a you know negative camber corner which is pretty fast so that's where I struggle with and then like long left hander and uh, you know quick right hander so it's very fun do you want to know how much rubber you're gonna pick up if you go offline check this out Day two of the racing, uh, beautiful morning here in Kandava. Um, yeah, it's a practice and then uh, semi-final and final. I love my morning coffee with milk, a little bit of uh, two-stroke uh, smell in it. Yanis, however, likes his coffee with a little bit of grease, right? grease. <laughs> and the oil <laughs> in it. Darmans Kanš, aiz viņa Romāns Padāns, Margus Kingu 11. Emils Kerīmovs 12. pozīcijā, tālāk Kristaps Kaliksons, Marijāna Baranovskaja, Mikolas Mazinas un Rūdis Kļaviņš. 16. dalībnieku mums DD2 Master klasē. Lēnum prātīgi rīko cauri parabolai. Starta līnijai un aiziet trasē DD2 Master klasē. Grūpē notur savu līderu pozīciju uztumi viņu līkumā. Tankevičus apdīvu turpina cīņu par pirmo vietu Jūris Zalīts un prīcēja aizmugurē trešajā ceturtajā pozīcijā. Tur kalnciems ar Freju cīnās, tur pat viņiem aizmugurē izbrauc ārpus kasta. Jums pakāpis uz sesto vietu un cīņa trešajā līgumā pamatīga sadurs mums saķeršanās. Mikola gal sedzās visas taisnas garumā. Turpat aiz viņiem romāns padāns jau tuvojas septītajā vietā. Eiktorijas brauc iekšā līgumā pa trases vidu. Neizdodas mūsam tik garām aizmugurē jau ir romāns padāns. Cīņa par piekto, sesto, septīto vietu līdz pašai pīniša līnijai pēdējās sekundes. Tikmēr āpļi beigām jau tuvojas Genrīs grūvu, paspēja pēdējās sekundēs aizbraukt vēl vienā āplī. Tātad divi rīņķi atliek līdz finišam. Vēl divas iespējas cīnīties Ivara Musam. Vēl divas reizes katrā līkumā jāmēģina. Un vēl viena sadurs mums starp pusu un zālīti. Saķeras kartīgu bamperi uzsīslīt no otrā līkuma. Un momentā šo situāciju izmanto Romāns Padāns. Padāns tiek garā Musam. Un tagad viņš ir nākamais, kurš atlikušajos divos apļos mēģinās apdzīt zālīti. Zālīts notur savu piekto pozīciju. I just want to give you uh, first impressions after the pre-final. Uh, yeah, my hands are still shaking because I was so uh, intense in the goal car. I was holding on to the steering wheel. Uh, I think we had about 16 laps. Um, start 10th, uh, finish uh, 7th, I think. I was in the 5th at uh, one point. 
and I lost two spots in the last lap uh, just because of the, the, the lap before when I stepped on the brakes really hard my front started shaking a little bit so I was a little bit worried I thought maybe there was uh, something loose in the go-kart or um, I don't know, it was just uh, very uncomfortable. So last lap I was not on the brakes as hard, and so the guys behind me were able to uh, catch up. And uh, and yeah, I overcooked uh, one corner, and they just, you know, uh, freight trained me, and uh, yeah, lost two spots. But overall, so happy. Uh, my best lap time is 43.0. Uh, the guy that won was 42.5, so I'm a half second off the... Uh, Cup guys, so yeah, I mean, this is a. I mean, you can see the smile, I mean, it's incredible. I'm so lucky and so blessed. Uh, half second, um, good race. Uh, I had the clean race, uh, obviously, I gained some spots because of some guys were shuffling up front. Uh, there were some emotions going on at the um, scale house, but nothing too major. Um, yeah, on to the final, whatever happens, happens, but so far, uh, half a second off the uh, top guy. That's um. That's an improvement. All right, see ya, I'll see you after the final. Margus Kingu, bet Marijane Baranovskie, Kristovam Kaliksonam, Mone Milam Karimavam. Īstāši nāsa pirmie ļoti lēnām izdrīpini vēl pēdējo pagriezienu un tad pilnā gāzē dodas trasē. Cīņa par līderu pozīciju, kur Rūbēm izdodas nobrebzēt uz pirmo līgu un nodarēt arī pirmo pozīciju, kā Kevičas un cieši viņam aizmugurē. Nāk taisnieki ar mežu atpakaļ uz šo trasu. Grūbe tam Kevičas un sei izskatās, ka viņi ir vienojušies savā starpā sadalīt dot vienas tālu pakāpienus. Līdz kalns iemām tur. Pirmā desmitnieku beigās pamatīga būrsma. Rūdz Kevičs, Hermans Kaķš, Reins Freis un Romāns Padāns. Mēr Kenriem Grūbēm jau no lūkumacā stundas uguņš pārsvars, tas vēl desmit ar kuļas sekundes priekšā Tankevičum, Lietuvietas otrais, Prīts sei trešajā vietā, arī tur vairāk viņš un Juris Zālīts cīņā par 6.7. opozīciju. Aiz viņiem Mikolas Mazinas un tad Romāns Padāns ar Mārtiņu Rolici. DD2 masterklasē uzvaru izcīnā Kenrijs Grūbē. Alright, I guess you can see I just came back from the final. Yeah, I started 7th, poor start. I uh, dropped to, I think, 12th, then uh, made my way back to 10th, and uh, yeah, just round of uh, strength and stamina. I'm happy because my lap times were apart with the first guy, and uh, half second off uh, winning guy. So, yeah, half second, more practice, uh, could probably uh, catch up slowly. Oh, it sucks that I'm not going to have a chance to drive for another year, maybe, or so. But uh, yeah, it was a good weekend, a lot of fun, made a lot of friends, and um, yeah, on to the next one. Alright guys, um, I'm back to beautiful Liapaya. It's about a two hour drive from Kandawa. I'm going to miss this place. Um, I'm flying out in about 30 hours or so. So I decided to spend my, you know, last night. Look at this beautiful beach and uh, sunset. 